welcome back to my channel. So today I'm showing you how to make this video. So this is a collaboration with a girl on Instagram. I've linked her Instagram in my description for you guys. So we decided on using the My Favourite Things Big Balloon Stencil. So we're both going to be using this, creating a different card. So I went to make a card for my granddad. So this is the Granddad Relaxing Goodbye Wild Rose Designs. And basically I'm going to be stamping the image onto my card with the sentiment. So it says happy birthday granddad and <laughs> I'm going to mask that off. So everything I used is in my description for you guys. So basically the girl that got in contact with me, she asked if we could do a collaboration in some way. And when I hear the word collaboration, sometimes I do panic and I think everybody does at some stage. But basically sometimes a collaboration could mean going on a Instagram live or you know, sending each other a sentiment stamped on a card base and we work around it. Um, so she said she didn't know which way she wanted to do a collaboration. So we decided to find something we both had in our supplies. And this is the first thing that I thought of. So I'm going to be using some Distress Oxides. And I have to admit, you do see me make a couple of mistakes. So realistically, I should have masked off the portions of the balloons that I didn't want stenc stenciling in um, because you do see me do that a couple of times where I've gone out of the lines onto another one and I've had to like come back in and fix it so sometimes things don't necessarily work out for you guys <laughs> don't automatically throw it away and try again try and work with what you have and fixing the issue so I'm going to insert some music because this is very self-explanatory I just picked a colour and then ink blended and then I'm going to colour in my image but I will talk to you guys when I add the final steps and make sure you head over to the girl's Instagram. I can't pronounce it so that's why I'm saying the girl. Um, hopefully she won't be offended um, but yeah definitely go check out her Instagram. She's not got that much posted on her page but I do think it's worth a look so I will talk to you guys when I do the final steps. And as you can see right now, I have two lines on this where I didn't need anything. So I'm going to go over that and fix it. So I will talk to you guys when I do the final steps.
finished colouring in I'm just bringing in the stencil again and I'm going to use my white pencil um, so I got this from the range and basically it's just a white crayon um, but sometimes you can buy white crayons and they don't leave a mark and it can be quite frustrating so I'm using the stencil with the highlighting for the balloons and I'm just basically going over that with that crayon and I just think it adds that final detail and then I did bring in Wink of Stella, added some to the book pages and also his hair so it kind of looks like he's like got silvery hair if that makes sense and I did also bring in glossy accents for the glasses and the liquid inside the mug and the last thing I did is I added some moonstones by Little Things by Lucy's to add some dimension to the card and I think it turned out really great it's not my favourite card I do have to admit but in the time frame I had to make this card I think it was definitely worth trying and I do like the look of it it just I don't know it doesn't scream amazing to me so maybe I should remake a card something similar but yeah that's it for the video guys make sure you go and head over to my Instagram and follow the girl that I mentioned and then also if you guys want to do a collaboration too let me know down in my comments or message me on Instagram like she, like the other girl there because that's the best way to get in contact with me I have to admit so everything I used is linked in my description as always and until the next video guys stay safe and happy crafting.